here in Lower Mainland, the way we have it, um, with the environment, with the outdoors, scouting is just, I mean, this is the ideal playground for scouts. You get to go on fun activities and stuff like that. So our programs are very community-based. Um, they're held in churches, they're held in school halls. You get to go camping and Play learn games. different and learn different things. You have to earn badges. I've been involved in scouting since I was five years old. And it's been my passion. I mean I enjoyed it when I was a child, as a kid, as a youth. Basically what we try and do is to make sure that we're attracting as many young people as possible into the organization. And with the way the Lower Mainland especially is, with the diversity, we have a very strong uh, emphasis on attracting uh, people, young people and adults from diverse cultures. Lower income families, they do get financial assistance if they request it. Um, we do hope to get everybody involved within scouting, so even people who uh, need financial assistance, we try to give it to them so that they can go to camps, so that they can come to events like this and so they can participate in our weekly meetings. Scouting is based on learning by doing. So a lot of the activities that we do are to teach them how to become more responsible, how to be more, uh, uh, you know, resourceful. And so the activities would involve a lot of outdoors, a lot of field trips, they'll be camping out in the, you know, and we've got beautiful, I mean, our weather's been great, so we do a lot of that uh, outdoor activities. So scouting is very much outdoor oriented. So it's not just, uh, you know, meeting in, in school gyms, or, or, or church basements. It is trying to get out into the outdoors, learning about nature, learning about the environment, and also doing conservation projects. Getting out, helping in the streams, like, you know, stream keepers, they're part of stream keepers, they're planting trees, um, they go hiking, and also cleaning up the uh, environment wherever they are. Oh, they get very excited, as you can see right behind me. They're all yelling and screaming, and the camps and everything, that's when you really see the excitement come out, when they wake up at 5 a.m., and they get all the leaders to wake up at 5 a.m., too. Yeah, help them, help them. Well, it's definitely a lot of fun for me. I started out myself way back in, I think, 96 or 97, so I sort of get to experience things from the other side right now. Um, it's lots of fun teaching the kids and seeing them learn and develop over the years, too. I climb mount mountains, I climb Mount Kenya, Mount Kilimanjaro through my scouting experience. And through my scouting experience, I've met some amazing people. People who you wouldn't have really thought you would meet. And Vancouver Foundation has always been there for, for Scouts Canada in the Lower Mainland, as well as in the rest of the B uh, British Columbia, to assist in different projects. We basically work with Vancouver Foundation to fund a multicultural worker over time. And that basically was the impetus to, to get more into the diverse communities.